。我是程玉，呃，琵琶演奏者。今天呢，我们在伦敦大学亚非学院的布鲁奈尔音乐厅，呃，给大家带来一场非常独特和别致的音乐会——丝绸之路上的柳特琴。嗯、呃，这个可能是在英国也是第一次，呃，也是我们今年的艺术节中间的一个亮点之一。My name is Shevet. I am a Uyghur musician. Today I play three different instruments: the duta, sata, and trawab, all of Uyghur traditional instruments. I played lots of Turkish classical music in the past 10 years. So and I want to play Turkish classical makam music with the Uyghur traditional instrument. This is also new. Yeah. The damba is actually the national Kazakh instrument, and the art form, which is called kue, and kue is um, basically a short instrumental piece played on the damba. Um, and this art form is being taken up in the UNESCO catalogue of um, intangible cultural heritage. I'm Puyan Bigla. I'm an Iranian musician and uh, a tar player. Mm, tar is an, is an old instrument in Iran. Improvisation is one of the one of the, the mode in Iranian dance music. My name is Ahmet Ozan Baysal. I'm coming from Turkey, and this is my instrument, balama or saz. There is a special connection with the Silk Road because Turkic tribes traveled and migrated through the Silk Road to Anatolia. So the musicians of these instruments are strictly bound to these traditions. Really excited about today and really joyful because this smaller version of the Silk Road uh, lute uh, is a really a manifestation of human imagination. I'm Elizabeth Knott. I play the rek, the bendir or tar. I like the contrast of the uh, sounds. One is soft and calming, like the tar, and the rek is a bit more fiery and unexciting. 中国文化呢，不只局限局限于中国。那么我们其实，在古代的时候就有已经跟呃丝丝绸之路上这么多的国家在交流，互相融合，互相分享。所以这次等于是一种丝绸之路的重新的一个回响吧。